it's Sarah from Just My Typewriter, and I'm here today with my friend Marcus, and we're gonna do some timed typing tests. Today we have a Smith Corona Classic 12 with us, and this is actually my boss's old machine that he gave to me. Um, and he typed his dissertation on this, and today we will be typing his least favorite poem, The Raven by Edgar Allan Poe, to do some time <laughs> tests and see what our words per minute are on a typewriter compared to each other. All right. Do you want to go first? Or um, do you want me to go first? I I have no problem going first. Yeah. I just need like an overview okay. of what to do. You just roll the paper through. Isn't oh that magical? Gosh, that's so cute. <laughs> so this is your enter button. Okay. You get to the end of the line, you hit this guy, and it'll advance the paper. I also have a We Are Memories Keeper ribbon on this, which has blue on the bottom, so if you switch it to this, you can type the whole poem in blue. Ooh, I'm gonna do blue. Okay, we'll leave it on blue <laughs> for you. And then apostrophe is Is that, blue. shift okay. on the eight. Wow, okay. You got this. This is very different. I'm gonna really come over. You're gonna be fine. Bring this back. Yeah, bring it closer to you. Perfect. Which side do you want the poem on? Uh, this right side? side, okay. Okay. You got it. And I'm gonna time you for a minute, and then we're gonna count how many words you have. I just want my mom. Oh my god, you're gonna be fine. Okay. All right, got my timer ready. Are you ready? <sighs> I think so. You got this. Okay. In three, two, go. Is this, where's the space? Where's the space? Oh, that's the space. <laughs> okay. Um, enter. Yep, there you go. Yeah, yeah. One, stop. No! That was oh, one minute. No. I didn't even get to the I know, line. it's okay. 14, 15, 16, 17. 17 words in one minute, that's not terrible. That's really good. That, no, it's <laughs> not. That is so much better than a lot of people who have not been on a typewriter before. It takes them a while to get the hang of it. That was really cool. Right? <laughs> that was really cool. Now I'm addicted. You're going to be great. Thanks, Mom. <laughs> no problem, sweetie. All right. I'm all set to go. All right. Are you ready? Sure. <laughs> In three, two, one, go. Oh, it's so much harder when someone's watching you do it. I won't watch this. Three, two, one, hands up! Six, seven, eight, nine, 29! And you have, what we say, 15, 13, 17. Less than 29. It was 17. That's not bad. Yeah, I would do this again. Well, I've got, you know, 15, 16, you can always borrow. <laughs> and you know what? I just might type paper like this. The keyboard is such a departure from this. Yeah, for sure. But that is more fun. <laughs> it's definitely more fun. It's super tactile. Yeah. Um, and what I like about it is you can see what you're doing and it's immediately produced on a piece of paper. Sometimes when you're typing in a Word document, it's hard to feel like you've accomplished anything. Yeah. So you can see the page count happening, but unless you print it, it's just a digital file. Yeah. What's nice about typewriting stuff is that it's immediately something that you can hold yeah. and like put in a binder. I save every scrap of typewritten thing ever. And it was something that Tom Hanks said in the documentary. Yeah, I know. Save these. I'm gonna save those. Yeah. Nice. I'm gonna make you sign that one. Oh yeah. Something Tom Hanks said in the documentary was that he typewrites all of his thank you notes to people because he knows that people save them. Yeah. And he's had people that he sent notes to that have actually like framed them and hang them up on their wall. Because it's something that's, it takes time, right? This is like a hard process. It's not, it's so much easier to go out and send an email to somebody. Oh, but, absolutely. Yeah. Absolutely. Even in that case, my grandmother, whenever she sends me a card or I send her a card, yeah. I always, always make sure that I write something yes. out. Because she's from a generation where, you know, writing was the way of communicating yeah. for the most part. Yeah. She didn't grow up with the internet yeah. or with the computer. Or let a, well, she probably did grow up with a typewriter. Yeah. I don't know. <laughs> but that's just one of those things that 
I've realized, you know, if you really want somebody to take something to heart, yeah. write it out. Because it's so easy for me to type a text on my phone and send it and not mean any of it. But if I have to lug out one of my typewriters, load it with paper, and then actually put a postage stamp on it to mm -hmm. send it to you, I put time and effort into that. And I think that's what's really cool about typewriters. Thank you guys so much for watching this video today. If you're interested in more YouTube content about typewriters, check out this channel, Just My Typewriter. We also have an Instagram, Just My Typewriter, and a Facebook where we post a lot of content about typewriters, pictures of my collection, me challenging other people to type tests. I want to thank you guys so much for watching today and thank Marcus for being here. And I want to remind you guys that you're just my type writer. Ooh. You know what else you can do? This huh. is Sarah Everett typing off. Ooh, I like that. Sarah Everett <laughs> typing, typing off. And you should have that. Ding. <laughs> there we go. Okay. This is Sarah Everett typing off. <laughs> I like it. <laughs>